Hi everyone, welcome back to the channel. In today's video, we're talking about something that might look simple, but is super important in building design. The distance between columns. Have you ever walked through a, const a construction site and noticed how those vertical columns are placed at regular intervals? Well, that spacing isn't random. It's carefully calculated to balance strength, safety, and cost. Part one, what are columns? Let's start with the basics. Columns are those vertical members that carry the weight of the structure above. The beams, slabs, walls, everything, and transfer it down to the foundation. They are like the leg of table. If they are too close, you waste you waste material, and if they are too far apart, the table might collapse. So, engineers need to find that sweet spot. Not too close, not too far. Part two. Factors that decide columns spacing. Now, how do we decide how far apart columns should be? There's no, no single magic numbers, but there are several factors that affect it. Number one, load on the structure. The heavier the load, like in high rise building or bridges, the closer the columns need to be. Number two, Architectural lay layout. The building's design and room size also play a huge role. You don't want a column right in the middle or your living room right. Number three, function of the building. A warehouse or parking area might need wide open space, meaning the columns are spaced further apart. Number four, Type of materials reinforced concrete, steel, or composite materials each allow different spans because of their strength and stiffness. Part 3 Minimum distance between columns. So let's talk the numbers. The minimum spacing between two reinforced concrete columns is usually around 2. 0.5 meters distance minimum 2.5 meters equal about 8 feet why not closer because if you place columns too close it increases the number of columns which makes the structure expensive and reduce usable space part 4 maximum distance between columns. Now, on the other hand, the maximum span for normal re residential and commercial structure is usually about 7.5 meters. Or roughly 25 feet. If you go beyond that, the beams spanning between columns become deeper and heavier, which again raises cost and may create deflection problems. But remember, with proper design and stronger materials, even larger spans can be achieved safely. Part 5. Cost and Design Balance Here's something interesting. When you increase the distance between columns, you might save on the number of columns but the beams and slabs between them need to be thicker and stronger so there's always a trade-off between materials cost and architectural flexibility engineers try to balance this to to achieve an economical and safe design so to wrap it up minimum Column spacing 2.5 meters or 8 feet. Maximum column spacing 7.5 meters, roughly about 
25 feet depends on loads building function material function materials and design layout the key takeaway column spacing is not fixed it's all about balance and purpose whether it's a small house or a tall skyscraper the goals is the same keep the structure safe strong and efficient thanks for watching if you found this video helpful hit that like button and subscribe for more engineering contents like this and let me know in the comments what topic should we cover next thanks